mistakes, wala akong gusto bagoy because those mistakes made me learn. No? It, it made me feel like, eto ka eh, tao ka, magkakamali ka. But you have to learn from it. But if there's one thing na hindi baguhin eh, what I wanted to say is, sana may gusto ako mangyari na hindi na pwede mangyari. That is, um, of course, I lost my mom when she was 44 years old, 54 years old. Sa tuwing ginagawa ko tong mga ganitong bagay, it feels, it feels sad and happy. It feels sad kasi hindi siya physically nandito. But I felt so happy because I know she sees me. Yung, yung lahat ng achievements ko, parang nakakahinayan, hindi niya nakikita ng physically. But then I always felt that, Ma, this is for you. Yung ganun. So, nothing I would like to change, no? What I, yung mistake na nagawa natin, nagawa na natin yun. But we have to learn from it and never ever do it again. Oh, including in your love life, di ba? May ganun. Oo, ganun na nga. <laughs> Good luck in your international competition. Thank you so much. The shock si Bobby. Any more questions for? Tita Lovina, yeah. Yeah. Hi, Mr. Shell. Good evening. Hello. Good congratulations. Thank you. So, they mentioned nila kanina that um, you will have a longer time to prepare. Did you have to make any like major adjustments? Because if I remember correctly, and napag usapan yun naman, you had your eyes set on a particular crown. Yes. And that did not um, happen. But did you make any adjustments? Because even in pageantry, like for example, gusto mo mag Miss Universe, napunta ka sa Miss International, iba yung hinahanap sa Miss International. So you have to change your styling, change the way you act, and the way you move. But this time, did you have to make any other changes para mag-fit lalo dun sa profile nila? Yes, actually, one of the requirements na sinasabi ng aking mga kasama is, and which also I am admittedly, kailangan kong gawin, I really have to use a little more weight. Miss Michelle, lang pa yan yun, ano, September, nag-uusap kami ni Anton, habit, kasi chinet ko ulit yung post namin eh, sabi ko, kamusta naman yung ako, eto pa rin. <laughs> No, uh, kasi alam mo yun na uh, let's face reality. When you enter a pageant, part of it is your physique. I cannot, I cannot, I uh, know, I cannot convince the judges, the people that I can win this title if I will not look like a perfect beauty queen. Of course, um, you yung isa. Pero that doesn't mean na uh, magpapakapayat ako na. No, 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 not that, not that way. Actually, mas gusto ko yung sabihin na I'm doing it in a healthy way. And siguro ito yung result na nagagawa ko siya. And of course, nandun, kaya nga sabi ko kanina, even my communication skills, I have to improve. So isa rin yun. This is, I'm going to join an international pageant. And definitely, English is one of the major language that, be, that will be used. So I have to really make sure na I can communicate properly. Diba? So, if they see it that way, mas madali, mas meron akong chance. Because they can see na, uy, kaya ko. Diba? So, with regards to other aspects, wala naman ako masyado nakikita. Kasi, when I check yung past pageants of uh, Mrs. International, hindi naman siya ganun katinte yung hiningi. But of course, kailangan ko nang i-internalize na I am a beauty queen and I have to act as one. And then, Ms. Michelle, my second question is mostly about your wardrobe. Yes. Um, so, right now in pageantry, we have a trend of um, using a lot of Filipino artisans, Filipino textiles. We can see that in the girls that we are fighting internationally. But what about you? Do you have also plans to um, showcase maybe the workmanship of people from Albay, people from your hometown? Yes, actually, um, nung itong national pageant ko, I'm supposed to wear 
a Filipina made of ano, cinnamon. But unfortunately, after the Bagyong Tisoy, the designer who's supposed to finish the gown, he didn't make it dahil nawala ng kuryente and the resources cannot be available anymore. There's no transportation during that time. And thank God, Tito Enrique saved me. Of course, I still wanted to, if ever that I am going to wear a national costume, you know, I, I, am, I am very thankful first no, that I have met a lot of creative um, designers at ang humusay nila, I cannot even, alam mo yung pipili ka na isa, ang hirap kasi ang gagaling nila. I would like uh, to really, ano, to showcase uh, ano, a strong, uh, loving, ganon yung, yung andating Filipina na na kakaiba na uh, and I'm wearing this um, uh, materials na talagang Filipino I would be really so proud Maraming salamat Thank you and so much that, so Of course we will support you Thank, Thank you. you So much, Tito Lavinia and Sir Mike Francisco